Okay. I think we're back. And we're no longer flashing. Welcome back. Oh, everybody. <laughs> So, we've come back to the, uh, we've come to the end of the dual signings here, the live on-camera signings. The last recipient is Karina Pemberton. So Karina, you're the lucky last for today. Uh, if you didn't manage to get a live signing of the two of us on camera today, oh, it's gonna be a while. It'll be a while till we do that, probably next June or something like that. Um, but uh, but anyway, but single ones, well, I'm sure we'll do another one, another session. Yeah, I mean we could do them live without being together, but we, that would be hard because yeah, that's hard. Good. Yeah. yeah. Doesn't really work like that, does it? We're in different locations. But if you don't want them signed on camera, we could definitely get two photos signed by each of us uh, off camera and we'll get them to you. Might take an extra week or two, but anyway. Do you want me to cut this out on a plate? Do you want me to heat it up? Oh. Mm -hmm. No? Do you want well, it might else? melt. Let's go chop it Oh, oh. Do you want me to just chop it up on a plate? Sure. Oh. Oh. So solo photos, do we want to go one at a time or just hand to each of you as you go through your lists? Oh gosh. Okay. Yeah, okay, so now we're going to do single photos. Um, we can start with you, Martin, because you've got the majority of them. I think it's my list is, uh, my list is still on all the duels. Um, so you got to change it to... Just you, go up to the top and just press the Uh, I'm sure really put this through there. Oh. Uh. Okay, Yi. This is for Lee, Yi. Uh, Yi Jia. Uh, oh. Hello to the Lee sisters. I can do that. Hello to the Lee. Make sure I spell that right. L Y Lee sisters. Okay. With love. There we go. Kiss. Um, it's a little pastry. Well, thank you. There's a little note for you, but I'm gonna keep that secret between you and I, ye. Nothing like, nothing like that, nothing like, oh, oh my God, look at this. What's in here? Chocolate? 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 And hazelnuts. Oh. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh. Mm. Inspired me to buy a sailboat, and now I'm in the planning phases to sail the South Pacific. TJ, you have no idea how happy that makes me. The fact that someone actually believed me when I explained that living on a sailboat is possibly the greatest way to experience this uh, earthly experience. So, I am so happy for you, TJ. Um, so to TJ, TJ, stay inspired. 
Oh my goodness, that is such good advice. All right, TJ. I have one from um, from Kim here. Uh, I love Virgin River. I'm your biggest fan. You and Martin are the best. And what you do for the your fans is amazing. So great to uh, that you are doing this. Thank you. Made my day. Happy day. Happy day. Kim. That's for you, TJ. Happy sailing, safe sailing. Hope you have the best adventures ever. And I'll see you out there. I'm gonna be yeah. in the South Pacific probably in a, let's say a couple of years. I'm gonna have my boat there. So I'll see you in Tahiti. Mm. Okay, Olivia. I'm so jealous. Oh, uh, you guys can come. Mm. Come and, you do the easy part, just fly in, fly out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the kids, your kids will be old enough then. My kids are much better at in a few years like a couple of years swimming now yeah I'm getting a pool so to Olivia oh yeah they're gonna be little water babies this one's for Debbie this is for you Debbie I know nothing about you there's no special instructions but that is for you and this is to Olivia hi Olivia from California um, she loves Virgin River, it's an escape, especially when things get stressful. She's in a teaching program. Wow, what a couple of years that must have been for you, eh? Well, congrats on getting through what I'm sure was chaotic and frustrating. Um, thank you for playing a part in that. Oh, I'm glad that we helped you get through a stressful time. Wish I could meet you at Jack's bar. I would love any personal note from you. Oh, let me write something on that. Okay, Olivia, let me write a little something. Um, this is for Diane, and Diane would like me to say excited for you to see season five. I am excited for you to see season five. I'm also, to be honest, I'm a little bit nervous about some of the fan reactions. A little nervous. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> 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 it's going to be an interesting season for y'all. It is an interesting season for everybody. Yeah. Um, there's a lot going on in season five, don't you think? Oh, so much. So many storylines, there's so many big events that take place. Do we have a spare one of those? I kind of screwed it up. Yep. Oh, sorry, Olivia, I got a bit, um, my blood sugar's getting low. Yeah, season five. See, I anticipated your needs. Thank you. Look at me. Thank you. Season five is gonna be Really? It's gonna be new, there's a lot of newness. There's new characters, new relationship. A lot of ending, a lot of beginning. There's more action. Like it's, a, it's, it's gonna be in some ways quite different, but obviously it's gonna be the same show, but I think it's gonna offer more dimension to the characters and the storylines. You have next? Okay, to Olivia. Um, this is for Penny. I think this is, I think we signed a duo for Penny. Because she said the same thing here. She loved, loved, loved Virgin River. She's almost embarrassed at how many times she's watched it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. What's her name? Penny. Penny. Oh, she wants a single. Nice. Mm -hmm. There we go, Olivia. That's coming to you. Keep it in the day, Olivia. That's my advice to you. When things get stressful, just remember, it's only Saturday. Don't worry about Sunday too much. Okay, this is to Beth from Pennsylvania. Loved you and Grace, and really love you, Virgin River. Please write whatever comes to mind for my photo. I love whatever you put on a oh. car. Thank you for bringing Jack to life. Look at you, you're so serious in your doctor wear. Oh yeah, he was a, um, he, a Doctors Without Borders. What do oh. they call it when they go and do, yeah. Oh yeah, he was involved in Doctors Without Yeah, he was in Afghanistan or something. Um, okay, so this is to Beth. I feel like this color might be good, yeah. Oh, two. Beth. Hmm. I have one to check to Terry. We 
know nothing about you, Terry, but we're sending you love from Vancouver. Is that Terry? Terry. Whoa, Terry. <laughs> there you go. Well, I've got one for Karen. My mum loves Virgin River. I watched all four seasons in four days. Karen! Wow. Karen, that's a, that's, that's a lot of TV. That's a lot of hours. Four seasons in four days. That might be a record. I mean, it is possible. I, it's, that's like, what? The entire eight waking hours a day. Yeah. At least, right? Yeah. Because they're, they're not 40. four hours. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So you basically... Tweedledee and Tweedledum over here. <laughs> Everybody. <laughs> 40 minutes times 10. 400 minutes. Okay. Jack and Mel, so sweet. It's for my mom. Oh, I got it hooked on Virgin River. Thank you for being so great. Oh, sorry about Sammy. Thank you, Karen. I appreciate that. Uh, okay. Two. Karen. C C H. Oh, thanks. Yep. Sometimes I do that. <laughs> your, your mom. Okay, your mom must be Karen. Sometimes I start writing the ends of words before I, I write the beginning too. of the words. I'll get full sentences ahead of myself sometimes. Uh-huh. There you go, yeah. Karen. It's coming to you. Dyslexia. At least they've gotten a handle on dyslexia in schools now. Don't you think it's a little bit better than it was? Because when I was a kid, I had dyslexia, and they just put me in, um, you know, a full special learning program, but, you know, with all the other kids in the school, and I just got teased all the time. Right, and you felt like you were, were you behind them? Were you I struggled? became behind them, I couldn't catch up, like it was just a total disaster. Yeah, well I think system. we've come a long way in understanding mm -hmm. what it is, and also understanding that with the right way of teaching, it can actually be a giant advantage, right, because the brain works mm -hmm. in a it works better in some ways than someone who's not dyslexic. Yeah. Great. <laughs> I don't know anything about that. That's great. Oh, come on. You're very smart. Oh. You are. So, I think it becomes an advantage in many ways. But I get what you mean. When, when we were kids, they didn't really understand it in the way they do now. Okay, this is to Sylvia. With love from Martin Henderson to... Sylvia. With Rachel. Rachel love. wanted me to surprise her with a, a note and I I got lost talking about dyslexia. So I just said thank you for watching. <laughs> I forget quotes, I can't remember. Quotes are hard. Quote. Here we go. There you go, Sylvia. <coughs> with love to you. Uh, next we have Esther. Spelled E S Z T E R. Dear Martin, I'm an ophthalmologist. If you need some help with your for your eyes, oh, Esther, where were you a few years ago? <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, thanks to these glasses, now I can read your name perfectly well. Um, I have another penny. There's so many pennies. Who knew there's so many pennies in the world? E S Z T E R. Um, with love. This one's to an absolute to Penny, an absolutely addicted fan. There you go, Esther. Oh. Hopefully, I won't have too much trouble with my eyes, <laughs> but I'll uh, I'll remember you. Okay, Jules. Were they always that bad? I mean, I you never you haven't been wearing glasses for the last few years, and all of a sudden you've got these thick as hell. I mean, well, only, they're happened? only thick. They're only thick on the bottom for reading. Yeah, but they're. But see, the top's not that bad. Distance, I'm fine. See, the top's not that much. It's just down there when you read. <laughs> Oh. I know. Season Woo! two was when I first noticed I was trying I've to read the mini slides. So and I'd be like, oh, I can't read that anymore. <laughs> and then for the last three years, I've pretended I'm fine, and then it started hurting me so much. Mm. This year, I had this weird ache across my forehead, and I went to the ophthalmologist. Oh. <laughs> <And>, uh, <laughs> yeah. 
And uh, they were like, yeah, you need glasses, buddy. So. Yeah, I have some glasses. For It'll happen to you. It'll happen to you soon. Oh, stop it. I, I can't see tiny print anymore. That's done. Thank you, Rebecca. Rebecca. Kiwi Rebecca. Chick. Ah, Kiwi Chick. Sorry, not to stomp on your, your uh, Rebecca there, but this is to Jules. Kiwi Chip! Kia ora, Jules! Happy 50th, girlfriend! Or maybe she's not a Kiwi Chick. Maybe her last name is literally Kiwi Chick. Could be her social handle, too. Um, mm. To Jules Kiwi Chick. Anyway. No, I'm pretty sure it's. A Kiwi girl, right? Yeah. Okay. Happy 50th, girlfriend! Okay. Olivia from California says that you're signing a print for her too. Um, I think we did a joint one to Olivia and California. You just did a solo for her, actually. Ah. Oh, I did a solo. Okay, there you go. Olivia, <laughs> you're getting, getting them all. That one's for Jules. Kiwi check. Kiwi check. Kiwi check. I like that. Happy birthday. Oh! Special happy fifth birthday. Happy five birthday. No, they meant 50th. Yeah. Happy birthday to Jules. Cool. The big 5-0. You know, the big 50 is the new 35. You hear that? I hope so. She's in a teaching <laughs> program. I'm hoping so, too. I think you're stressful. A teaching program. Dearest Tracy. Are you learning how to teach? A teaching program? I didn't... Yeah, I just... Oh, I actually thought she was... Program. Yeah, I reckon she's learning how to teach. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's that's cool. That is that does sound stressful. <sighs> yeah. I mean, it's one of the most underpaid, most important jobs in society. You really that and nursing, right? Like mm -hmm. without those two professions, we're all screwed. Okay, dearest Tracy, smart and beautiful. <laughs> smart and beautiful? Question mark. All my love. Um, <laughs> it's I don't okay. Think that's how she would like that. No, I think that's for her. Oh, yeah, that's for yeah. her. I'm going to say, <clears throat> Dearest Tracy. Racy Tracy. Smart and beautiful. I'm not, it's not a question mark. I'm just going to say, You smart and beautiful. Olivia, Thanks. I wrote you a note. I wrote you a little note there. Oh yeah, one of these ones. There you go, Tracy. Racy Trace. Francine Lopez. I'm going to gift this birth picture for my aunt, Michelle, who lives in Brazil. Please write to Michelle. She's a fan of Virgin River and Grey's <coughs> I am Fran, living in North Vancouver. Oh, they're right over there. Right across the water. Oh! Say hi, Francine. Hi, Francine. This, hi, one Francine. Is, this one is to Lynn. This is for you, Lynn. I like this picture of this Ooh, one. I took oh, this. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I took this while I was doing um, the last season of This Is Us in uh, LA, so I had some long hair. Wow, that's a nice photo. Yeah. Yeah. I actually was able to uh, dye it before I did that show. Wow. Now I just sit here and eat pastries with Martin. Your, your hair's looking less orange though. No, it's, it's settled, it has, it's settled down a bit. I need to wash it. No, it's again. good. It's a little bit. It's nice. <laughs> I had my hair dyed a few days ago and it had become so... <laughs> it was bright orange. <laughs> it became so blonde that you had to put, you know, so much more copper tones in it, but it was just a little bit much. It was... Whoopsie. You'll, when you get to the point in season five where my hair becomes orange, you'll know what we're talking about. <laughs> it was only a couple of days though, right? It's already settled down. Yeah, but that was a lot of... Those those are a lot of scenes. <laughs> That's a lot of scenes where Mel's hair is orange. Uh, no, I'm good. Look they're nice. gonna have a really fun time color correcting that. You're right. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay, this is to Francine. Oh, it's for oh, her yeah. aunt who lives in Brazil. No. No, 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 it's not. I'm not sure your name. You live in North Vancouver. You and your husband would like a coffee. Um, 
Her aunt lives in Brazil. Yeah. Please write this out to and Michelle. Then, oh, Let me get your name. Screwed letters. it up. You know what? Let's. I'm just gonna do one to Francine. Uh, may as well. And, if, yeah. and you know what, Francine? If you don't want it, give it to someone you know called Francine who might. <laughs> so that's gonna come to you with the one for your aunt, Michelle. I who have, lives in Brazil. I have one for Marianne in Ohio. Ohio? Mm. Marianne, mm -hmm. do you have that accent? It's so good, this pastry. That was mm -hmm. such a good idea. Mm. Marianne from Ohio? No, that's Minnesota. Mm. Ohio. Hi, Adam. Cincinnati. Cincinnati is... How do they speak in, in Cincinnati, Ohio? What's the it's kind of most middle dominant? American. It's like, it's like middle American. I had... I did a movie across the border from Cincinnati. Is it Kentucky or Indiana? There's, oh my God. I forget, but I think it's like a general American. To Michelle, with one L. Yep. This is to Maria, is that Jose? Maria Jose. Yeah. Okay, Francine, it's coming to your aunt. No, yes, your aunt Michelle in Brazil. Okay. Maria Jose is from Chile, and she has an account, Alexandra Brecken. Brecken Chi. Oh, Chile. like a Chilean right. thing. Oh, that's nice. Super excited to have this great opportunity. Lots of kisses. Lots of kisses to you, Maria. Here's another picture from that same photo shoot. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow, shoot. they got you looking sexy for um, This Is Us, huh? Well, no, no, no. This was a separate photo shoot just to have some pictures because I literally hadn't taken a picture since I had my daughter. So it was like. Yeah, I don't have a headshot like since like. But that's why. 10 years ago. That's why I did a. I was like, maybe we should have some new photos. Yeah. <laughs> yes. I should do that. Turn 40. It's a good idea to have new pictures. Okay, Jenna, that's for you. Uh, come visit Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania someday. I might just do that. How about those Steelers? Um, good luck with the rest of the football season. And thank you for your love of the show, Jenna. Okay, next is Evis Hall. Evis. Okay, it's a cool name. Evis, Evis, Evis. Sophie. <clears throat> to Hannah. All right, Evis or Evis. Much love to you, from me to you. Here we go. It's on your way. Next. This is to Hannah from uh, Mary Sophie. I'm a dentist. Please write anything you desire to write me, Martin. Um. Wow, a dentist. Dr. Miriam, Miriam Green. All right, that's two. Dr. Miriam. Devia, Devia. Um, I said it'd be, it'd be, it'd probably pronounce Devia, but I'm just guessing. Fantastic name. Really is. Tavia is a doctor in the UK. She'd love to work with me and Doc. Well, if we knew what we were doing. <laughs> Maybe. That'd be great. She, she could be a, <laughs> one of your medical technicians. Yeah. Okay. Talk to Marion Green. Here you go. Thanks for keeping everybody's chompers strong and sparkling. Uh, I've got a lot of respect for dentists. I think that'd be a hard job. That would be such a hard job. Okay, this is to Sarah. Could you, Martin, please add the caption? Happy birthday. Oh, my wife's birthday. Oh, that's nice. Okay. To Sarah. Happy. 
my special instructions. Just wanted to let you know that you're my fave. Thanks. Happy birthday. Sometimes that's all you need to do, right? Yeah. Courtney, I'm excited for season five. As I've said, I'm also getting a little bit nervous. <laughs> oh, it's going to be a great, it's going to be a great one. Here you go, guys. That's for Sarah. Happy birthday. Well, she probably isn't watching because it sounds like it might be a surprise. But I don't know. If she is watching, <laughs> happy birthday, Sarah, in Invercargo. Hope it's getting warmer down there. And then we have Mandy. I love Virgin River. I watched all four seasons in four days. Oh, hang on. Nope, someone else who did that. I really wanted an autograph picture from Virgin River. Thank you for being this so great. This is for Courtney. Courtney, I hope you enjoy season five. I think, if anything, even if the bulk of the season makes people go, what's happening? The last couple episodes, which we were not, are not telling you what happens in the last two episodes. Ooh, but I thought you were going to. No, I'm not that stupid. Um, <laughs> you're gonna love it. You're gonna love it. Gonna love it. Gonna be your favorite. That's gonna be. Those are gonna be. I think some people's favorite episodes. Don't you think? 100%. Last two of season yeah. five. Yeah. There you go. That's to Mandy. Thanks for being such a super fan. Four seasons in four days. It's <laughs> a lot of love. That's a lot of love for you, Mandy. Okay, Deborah Thompson. D E B R A. This is from Mallory. Wherever you are in the world, Mallory. <laughs> there you go. Enjoy. Deborah Thompson. Okay. Coming your way. Christina, please sign. Always believe and have faith with love. Oh, Christina. With pleasure. To. Oh, here's Avril. She's the one that knitted those um, jackets and. Oh, the Kiwi lady. Uh -huh. Oh, oh, Avril Fairbrother. Avril, yes. Yeah, we missed. Uh, you saw her this year, didn't you? Uh, we met her at the bottom of the uh, gondola. I didn't see her. Oh, you went there that? No, I don't know. I didn't meet her. Oh, you had the scene earlier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. Avril came all the way from New Zealand and tracked us down while we were filming out in the mountains and... Gave us some lovely handmade goodies. She bothered to knit us jerseys and beanie and socks and she also dropped off a whole bunch of wonderful New Zealand chocolates and candy, which I've saved for two little people in my life that I think are gonna enjoy in a couple of weeks. So thanks for that. So this is for you. Thank you for the goodies. Thank you for the goodies. April. Sarah from Arizona. Hi, oh, Sarah from Arizona. It's hot in Arizona. It's dry in Arizona. Yeah. Dry. Okay, Christina. Always believe and have faith with love. Martin, to you. Okay, to Beth. Love Virgin River and love the fact mm -hmm. you are so down to earth. Not quite sure where, where else you, you could be, but anyway, keep making great shows and thank you for what you do for us fans. Hope to be able to meet you someday. Oh, Beth, thank you for your kind words. And with much love, sorry, <laughs> from me to you, that's for you, Beth. Okay. And then Rebecca, uh, oh, no instructions, okay, just two, Rebecca, two C's, yep. Last one is to Christina, maybe it was serendipity, did oh. I say that? I don't remember saying that. <laughs> yeah, I think you did. Did I say yeah, that? Yeah, the fans are always right, right. Yeah, you did. Did I say maybe it was serendipity? Yeah, when we were having a date in season one and we were talking about fate. And, oh, yeah. I thought I just said fate. I think you might have done both. Oh. Unless it was yeah. a different scene. 
Um, I'm sure she's correct. Yeah. <laughs> That's to Nancy. There you go, Nancy. Okay. Uh, Grey's Anatomy, just the episodes Martin is in. Aww. <laughs> That's very sweet, Laura. But if you watch Grey's Anatomy, you should probably watch the whole thing. There's like 15 or 16 seasons for you to is it? Is it think not? it's up to 16. Ah. Yeah. Don't At talk least. to me about that. <laughs> this is for Tamara. Thank you, Tamara. You're going to be like the Meredith Grey of Virgin River. I have watched Virgin River all seasons three times. Virgin oh, wow. Wow. Wow, Laura. What? That's a lot. She's watched all seasons three times. That's a shit ton of TV viewing. Wow. Um... Virgin River is a wonderful, romantic, realistic show. I hope it continues for many years. Oh, thanks, Laura. Think about, think about how many takes. Other things you could do with no, your no, life. No, <laughs> think about how many takes we do in a scene. So how many times we've done all the scenes that we've shot. Oof. Look how many times we've said those words over and over and over and over and over. Yeah, that's a lot. We should remember all of it, but yet our brains are revolving doors. Comes in one side and out the other. My brain is just trying to get yeah. ready for what's coming up next week and the week after that. Yes. Next week is a long week. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a big week. Yeah. A lot of actors in. Almost the whole cast. I think we're going to... Do another tortilla challenge with some. Oh, yeah, Alex came up with a really good idea. <laughs> Since our first tortilla challenge was such a non starter. <laughs> uh, well, I just, I, I mean. No, we all yeah. saw exactly what you just. <laughs> <laughs> I can't help it with what you want me to say. I can't. I've always oh, been like that. I've always. So if somebody funny. makes me laugh while I'm drinking something. It's, uh, you're in trouble. Game over. But we're yeah. going to do a group one with a bunch of cast. We have a lot of cast that are in on one day. So we'll get as many as we can together in a circle. Let's see, what are we you going to do? Six, like? Yeah, um, well, I think we should pick, I think there should, maybe should be rounds. We could do rounds or something where you, you have like Yeah, 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 and the, winner, and the winners meet in the final. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So maybe we'll have three rounds, or two rounds, whatever. You could do two rounds of three people. Yeah. And then you'd have a first and a second place. And then, I don't know, we'll have to come We'll up work it out, but we will have the, the Virgin River Tortilla Slap Championship. <laughs> the undisputed champion will be decided next week. Okay, this is to... It won't be me. Kleina. Kleina, uh, looks from Italy. No, Ireland, sorry. Uh, Kleina, what a great name. Can you add a cute quote from Jack? Thank you, I'm a huge fan. Thank you for all your hard work. No show beats Virgin River. Oh, thank you, Kleina. Kleina. Do you have any new funny stories with Alex Wells filming season five? Uh, um, is this one to... Is it Isa? Isa? What does it say? It says, sometimes I tell... Hi Alex, I'm a big fan from the UK, France. You are wonderful in everything you do. Keep smiling and dancing and hope to see you on our screens for many more years in VR. I love Mel and I sometimes tell myself to be more like Mel. Merci, oh. merci and a little heart. Oh, oh that's, that's a huge compliment. That's sweet. Sometimes I tell myself to be like Mel too. <laughs> <laughs> sometimes I tell Alex, like, can you be a little more like Mel right now, please? <laughs> Just pretend. <laughs> <laughs> Can you just... Clean up. Oh, oh, I screwed it up. Oh, what did you do? I spelled, I spelled it the way it's pronounced, not the way she writes it. Gosh, do you need some more food? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I totally do. Thank you. Mmm. Clean up. Okay. Annie Link might be coming to meet me in February with her brother, Ezra. The weather's good. 
Carolina. Oh, uh, yeah. Cool. Nice. Nice, Annie. Maybe I'll see you there. Good plan on. I can't, I, I hope that Corona's not raging. I can't decide if I'm gonna be masked up or not. I think I might be. I think I might be. What was that quote that we found from Jack before? Annie. What did, what you do? Wow, well, that was easy. Uh, I thought there was gonna be more back and forth, but um, did you come up with a Well, well, I, I do, but I can't give away yeah, something. Uh, yeah, I just thought of something too, but it's a spoiler, so it's not. Yeah. Um, some sunny, sunny, sunny fiends. There's some sunny fiends with Jack and his family. The Sheridans turn up with some funny stuff we did yesterday. But I can't give it anyway. Uh, yeah, do you have any funny stories with Alex while filming season five? Um, camping? Was anything funny happening camping? Um, no, my, the, the pipe burst in my B&B, &B. that wasn't very funny. No, that was, that was like the opposite <laughs> of funny. Well, it'll make you laugh. Tell her that story. Oh, no. Tell them how you ended up in this apartment. Oh, well, no, that wasn't here. I know. That's, well, I, I ended up at Wendy's after that. No, I went to, I went to visit my family. I think I probably already talked about this. One. I went to go visit my family, um, and then I came back, and I told the owner of the B&B that I was leaving, and I came back, and um, she failed to mention the fact that a pipe burst in the house, and there was a giant hole with caution tape around it in the front yard when I got out of my... Uber, and I walk over to the house and I'm like, oh my god, what's going on? And um, the, all the doors were unlocked, and uh, the stuff had been moved around because, and there was like a dehumidifier all over the place, and like clearly they'd been like draining through the washroom with a tubing, and I was just, I called her, all the water was off. I said, I can't, you know, what's going on? And she said, oh, sorry. I was like, well, it, it, what do you mean, sorry? <laughs> so, anyways, I left. But. We were doing this really heavy episode that week and I had to be up at 4 a.m. like consecutively for the next four days and I had to go live in a hotel um, and I packed up all my stuff and I just, gosh, that was really hard. Yeah, you had the worst luck. With that was really stuff. difficult. And your luggage got stolen? Oh, my husband's, yeah, my kids and my husband's luggage got stolen from the airport. But they found, they used the air tag. So these are really funny stories. And track. <laughs> Hope we're just... Cracking you up over there. Uh, yeah. Anyway, that was Baclana. Sorry, <laughs> that last one was Baclana. Um, I wrote a little quote there from great. Jack to you. Yeah, I can't remember anything like that funny that's happened. Not that we haven't had fun, it's just... We have fun all the time. I know. Pamela from Quebec says, um, hi. She loves love guys. Pamela. Um, I mean, funny things happen all the time I, at work, don't they? I just can't remember what they are. Um, I think if I ate some food, I might be able to remember a few things. Do you have more snacks? I have another sandwich for you. This is Margarita. Um, oh, this is to Margarita, another fellow Libra. Hey. This is from Pamela from Quebec. Okay, your sandwich. Oh, thank you. Um, so I guess the pastry wasn't enough. <laughs> uh, <laughs> all right, Margarita, my lovely fellow little Libra. This is coming to you. Sending you love and best wishes. Next, I have Anne Dorte Nielsen from Denmark. Uh, 
Oh, I see many of your films. I'm looking forward to seeing your work. Take good care of yourself. Thanks, Anne. This is for Jennifer. We don't know where you live, Jennifer. I hope you have a happy Saturday. And um, happy holidays when they come. I'm all ready for the holidays, obviously. I've got my holidays on. Those are great pajamas. I really got to get some for Billy. I, I wonder if I have some. I don't have a pair of pajamas. I literally had to borrow this from the costume department. Dare I ask you what you sleep in? Boxes. Oh, just boxers. Nothing else. Just boxers. See, oh, I boxes can't... and a pair of jeans and a hat. I mean, what are you? No, I mean like well? a shirt. I don't know. Oh, like a like t-shirt. Sweatpants. Like I don't know. No, no, no. Pair of uh, pair of boxes. Okay. Yeah. Because I get cold, and sometimes I have to wear a sweatshirt. I have a very light sweatshirt. Oh, I, I have a duvet. Bed. It's like it's filled with feathers, and then you can just pull it up. <laughs> you should try. Well, I, it's true. I have you wouldn't have to wear clothes. I still get cold. With a duvet. Yeah. Yeah. I can't wear just like underwear. You get cold. Yeah. Oh. Okay. <laughs> no, just boxes. Unless I'm wearing nothing at all. That's a conversation for another day. Okay. Okay, to Denise. <laughs> oh. <laughs> to Denise. All right, Denise, this is coming to your door, to your post office box or your mailbox real soon. Pal Here you go. Paloza. Paloza. Judy Paloza. Judy Paloza. Paloza. Paloza? Paloza. This is for my mom. She's a huge fan of yours, Brody River. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. This is for Judy. So this is for somebody's mother named Judy. Um, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year's, Happy Birthday. I have a I have a story. Oh, here we go. I have a story for you. Um, we had a scene where Alex were in the McRae cabin, and Mel has to wake Jack up, but his back's turned to her. And she comes up and says, hey, Jack, Jack. And Jack's supposed to turn around and be like, oh, hi, good morning. And then the scene goes on, whatever. But Alex thought it might be funny. No, that was Lynn's idea. Was it her idea? Yeah. Okay, my makeup artist, Lynn, decided it would be funny that while we were doing a take, instead of Alex waking me up, it would be her. So I'm all ready, I'm, you know, like, stand by, camera's ready, action. I'm pretending to be asleep, and then I hear this little footsteps come over, and then this hand touches me on my shoulder. I turn around, and it's my makeup artist. It was very funny. So I pulled her into bed with me. He, pull, he pulled her into bed <laughs> on top of him. That yeah, pretty good. pretty good. This is to Devon, um, McDonald. Where is she from? Ireland. Ireland. Oh yeah, that's was just from Ireland. Oh. I haven't been to Ireland in so long. I love the Irish. I love the Irish. Okay, this is to Michelle Keith. Oh, g'day, mate. Michelle Keith, all the way down there in Hunter Valley, New South Wales. Um, wants me to say hi. G'day, or hi. Um, but in all seriousness, thank you for your message about Sammy. Um, I appreciate that. And you said you know how that loss feels, which means you obviously lost your pup at some point. I'm sorry for you too. But we are lucky to have them for the time that we have them. So we can just cherish their memories. But thank you for that, Michelle. Sending you this with lots of love. Uh, this is a little sexy photo for Jeremy. Here you go, Jeremy. Ooh, Jeremy. Oh, get it. Get it, Jeremy. <laughs> Eat your food. Eat your sandwich. <laughs> Jeremy's gonna love that one. Oh. Jeremy's gonna love that one. Oh dear. All right. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Wow. Okay. Thank you. Okay, thanks for uh, thanks for watching.
watching me on, on Walking Dead. I wasn't the most popular character on that show, but you know. Like these next few for you are all to the same person. FYI. That's for Trish. Oh. Trish. With love and a little bit of salmon bagel. Here you go. Salmon mm. bagel. Oh, good idea. You want me to cut some off? No, no. Okay. No, no. Please, please, you eat that. <laughs> mm. Please. Do us all a favor, Martin. <laughs> yeah. Get some food into you. Now, this is to Judy. It's amazing to me how much food you can eat. Like, how much food I can eat? You eat a lot of food. You mm -hmm. eat all damn day. It's because this my one. my blood sugar can't hold the glucose. To yep. Osama. That's a cool mm -hmm. name. Nice. Osama. Yep. He's actually bought a string of them, so the next several are. Oh, they're Osama. all. Osama. Thanks for the patronage, Osama. buddy. Oh, These give, me, give me Judy back. <coughs> give me Judy back. I'm going to add something to Judy's. Glad you enjoyed the show. Sorry, Judy. I missed the special note. I'm going to add that. Osama, do you really enjoy Virgin River? What, because he's a dude? Well, no, it's just a lot of, it's Good just duty. several Virgin River. But are, are you sure that he wants them all to? Mm -hmm. so. mm -hmm. Lynn Van, Lynn Van Weertz, 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 I don't know. Lynn Van Weertz, nicknamed Lily. Hey, Lily. Oh, every time I watch Virgin River, I forget bad moments, see? That's sweet. Isn't that nice? It's so nice that, that has that effect on you. Thank you, Lily. Oh my gosh, she had two cancers in seven years. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. A, I'm a survivor. Aww. Wow. Lily, congrats. You must have a very, very strong spirit. A respect to you. I'm glad you fought and you're still in this wonderful world. Yeah, that's really hard. Well, to get through. Two. It's the first American horror story that I go through also. You know, the other ones are better the other ones they're better with the where you can see the full front the front of the main outfit with the mm -hmm. Yeah. That other one that other one was a people enjoy that one, I think, more than this one. Probably because this is not this is a little more creepy and the other one's really, you know, <laughs> you see the Yeah. Garter in the whole bit. Garter. What a funny thing. Life is funny. <laughs> Our jobs are funny. A strange yep. thing. There you go, Lily. Lynn, with love to you. All right. Sometimes I forget about this, you know, and then I look back and I see some like gif of me ripping off the garter belt or like my butt waving in the air, and I'm just like, what happened? <laughs> what a thing! Thank you. Yeah. Seemed like a good idea at the time. It really did. <laughs> it really did seem like a good idea at the time. People really enjoyed it. I'm sure they did. Yeah, I think they're continuing to enjoy it for years. Yeah, it's right? good. It's a gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> Osama, still going. We got a few more. Osama is you got a, a super big fan. fan. About one of each, I think. Oh wow. my gosh. I wonder where Osama lives. Oh, so this is the Dr. Marion Green again. Mm hmm. Okay. Wow. I'm just going to do Marion. Or does she want Doctor? No, I guess it's his doctor. Osama just wanted to watch me sit here and and write his name over and over again. I think he'd rather <laughs> watch you in a pair of suspenders. And... <laughs> suspenders? Or whatever you were wearing. A garter. A garter. A garter. <laughs> mm. a garter belt. Garter belt. Very low garter belt. Very high dress. 
Spiel da drin. Ähm Not, not your average squib. That doesn't no. sound like Virgin River. They did have a. <laughs> oh my god. They did have a. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> they had a. They did have a, um, a a line that went through her pant leg, and somebody was pumping, pumping the blood. blood from the what side. What show was that? Well, yeah, Walking Dead. Dead. That was so much fun. <laughs> that was the funnest. I had the best time doing that scene. You could tell on my face. Yeah, you're really going for it. I was. Yes. Changing gears a little bit, uh, <laughs> Dr. Marion Green, that's for you, sending you a little personal message. Thank you very much. And next we have Katie, you and Alex's sense of humor it warms my heart. Warms my heart. The cockles of my heart. Thank you from Colorado. Cockles. All right, Katie from Colorado. This is your last, your last Osama one. Okay, Osama, this is your last one here. <laughs> Are you cutting them off? Well, no, it's just the end of the line. It's okay. right. That's the one that he got. Here we go, Katie. Keep smiling with love from me to you. Oh my god, the sandwich is working a treat. Thank you. There you go. Oh, well, yeah. at least you brought, you brought extra food for yourself. Oh, yeah. Smart hands. Well, Bob, there's extra there. You want to, um, mm. forget what I got, but do the sandwich. This is to Kim. Kim? Oh, be still my beating heart. Oh. Okay, Kim, I'm gonna write that. To Kim. E. Alright. Sabrina. Sabrina Vogler. Mm -hmm. Oh, she was the first one we did today. Yeah, I was mm -hmm. like, I know that name. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know that name. This episode inspired me to buy a pair of binoculars. Huh. Oh, and look this at the eagle. sign, Virgin River, is a utopia. There you go. That's for Kim. Oh my God, she watched off the map. Wow, thanks for sticking around, Kim. Okay, Sarah, Sarah, hi from Sarah. From a big Jack Sheridan fan, could you please write to Sarah? Thank you so much for last night. Ha <laughs> Sarah, I thought that was our little secret. Now I've just said it publicly. Oh, cat's out of the bag. But Sarah, I think, yes. I'm very grateful for last night. Uh, that's Northern German humor, okay. I think that's New Zealand humor too, Sarah. This is for Sabrina. Um, for, uh, Virgin River is a utopia. Sure is. Sure is. Wish I lived there. <laughs> I live there in my land of pretend. You live there for four months of the year. I do live there for four months of the year, it's true. Thank you. Brian from so Winnipeg. Much. Got a cameo from you last year. Oh, for Brian. your birthday. Just want to say hi. Keep up the last amazing night. work. Hi, Brian. Hope you're doing well. In Winnipeg. I've never been there. That's Canada, right? Winnipeg? Mm -hmm. It's like... Yeah. Okay. 
Sarah, Sarah from Hamburg. Beautiful Hamburg for you. Hamburg, amazing. Germany. Brian from Winnipeg. To Gail, stay safe. Okay. Are you blanking out? No. Um, nope. I'm great. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, Gail. Mm. Mm. For you. Next we have Anna. Could you please write to Anna from Jack and from your awesome big sister, Sarah? Yes, I can do that. That's easy. Thank you once again from Hamburg. Oh. Oh, this must be the same one for someone else. Oh yeah, I go, I know what's going on here. Um uh, Shine on Sailor. Oh, thank you so much. Shine on you. Uh Sarah. But this is for Anna. So to Anna. Otherwise, it wouldn't be much of a surprise. But if she is, Anna, <laughs> would love for me to you. Maybe the surprise is to watch sitting this. Sitting here watching us for, for hours seven hours. And hours. <laughs> <laughs> surprise! <laughs> it's only been two and a half so far. Oh, we're, we're getting through. We're getting through it, guys. It's only been two and a half hours. I don't know what's worse. It's like let them order so many prints that they have to sit for hours and wait or limit the amount that they can Maurice Lucia yeah. it's a great name Lucia, I love that name Lucia Aquet Aquet Cindy from me to you babe It sounds like the autograph is to Belinda, and then she'd like me to give verbal shout outs to those other names. Oh, Avril's one that was too. Please give a shout out to Avril, Joanne, Carrie. Hi, Avril. Hi, Joanne. Hi, Carrie. Hi. That's for Courtney. That's for you, my love. She wants another cooking show, if Courtney does. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't know how we're going to squeeze all that in. I know, actually. I don't know, timing-wise, when we would do it. Belinda! Best wishes. Okay, Phyllis Trudeau. I think you got a joint one now. Here we go. A little hinder for you. Here we go, Phyllis. Linda. Oh, Linda's from Brisbane as well. Oh my God, Linda, let's talk about this for a second. First saw me in Echo Point. Wow. 
That show was pretty bad. We used to call it Echo. What's the point? <laughs> It was, oh it, was, it was pretty bad, but my God, Linda, thank you for staying with me for that many years and absolutely love Secrets and Lies. Oh, God love you, Linda. Sending you lots of love to Brizzy. Thank you for watching, Linda. Here we go. That's for you. Okay, this is to Mildred. Hey Betty, let's the Dominican Republic. Let's meet. Let's meet. Let's meet. Let's meet. Okay, Betty. Uh, this is for Betty. I'll meet you at Jack's for lunch, baby. It's for you, my love. Big shout out to my main boys, Petey and Chevy. Mwah. Love you guys. Can't wait to see you soon. You want an autograph, Petey? Yeah? Um, From Martin Airy? Happy birthday, Caitlin. <laughs> Love you guys. And this is to Tina. To Tina, thank you for being you. Love from Sweden. Aww. Love to you. It's starting to stink like a fish. No, that's why I offered you half. I thought it might be less offensive. Thank you. <laughs> there you go, Tina. You know what Martin does to me sometimes? He'll eat a tuna fish sandwich, or like a fish sandwich. Four season. It's not even like we're maybe we're not doing any of that stuff, but we're really close when we talk most of the time. We're right up in each other's business, and he can he can have some real some real fishy some real fishiness happening there. I'm gonna get you some more water, my friend. Oh, okay. thank you. <laughs> Take my mom. Yeah. You you had the odd. Uh, Bowl of tuna though while we've been working, but you always put those weird. I always spray use, your mouth with that horrible. Yeah, stuff. I always try to freshen my breath so that I'm not like. Hi. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> which is what you do. Too. I don't go like that. I go like. Hi. <laughs> you might as well. No. <laughs> No. Well, that's all they have to offer me sometimes. I get a bowl of tuna and then I got a, you know. Emily, I just thing. I just want you to know that your <laughs> photograph was used to waft away the um, smoked salmon. Smoked salmon stink that's coming off of 
Martin Henderson's brother. Oh right dear. <laughs> Who would have me? Okay, <laughs> to end. Please sign it. Thanks for watching. Best wishes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's only funny because it's true. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Mandy. Dad. Do you go, Ed? That's for you. Thanks for watching. Okay, this is for Tracy. All of the real estate here. Tracy. Oh, that's kind of cool, though. Mix it up. Make gold. it big. Maybe some gold. I like the gold. Yeah. To Tracy Lee. Oh, that was stupid, actually. This. Oh, uh, the well, color's probably not the Well, we're, we're creating a shirt. I know. We're creating a shirt. It's okay. It's alright, alright? It's alright. Yeah. Here you go, Tracy. Coming your way. Okay, this is for Robin Marianne Kristen. This one's for Brandon. Bunderson. Brandon Bunderson. BB. BB, I like that name. BB. Marianne is mum and daughters also watch Virgin River and your movies. Love getting cameos. More cooking on Instagram with Mel. Thanks for being so gracious with your fans. Ah, Guys, you don't have to thank us for being. Sign this for you. Miss the so you are on no, the joint signing. Miss... Well, I think because we have a limited amount of duo signings, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Okay. Um, she found the show while she was recovering from surgery. Yeah, I feel like a lot of people have told me that. They were recovering from something or they got sick and they started watching it and then they just kept on watching. Keep on keeping on, on people. I'm a bit confused here. It says to Robin, Marianne, Kristen, but I think that's three people's names because it says Marianne's mum. Sometimes it's for a whole so family. Maybe it's two all three. Yeah. So she do it to all three, right? Yeah. Okay. To Robin. Marianne, Kristen. Yeah, that looks like it's to the family. Marianne and Kristen. It's to you, Carmen. Thanks for Sign on live, can you say hi? Hi, Maddie. Florina, Florena, Florena. Maddie, Florena, yeah. Florena, yeah. yeah. What is that thing? That little... It looks like a mouse. Or something else. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh. I really don't know. Oh, I'm gonna leave that one alone. I don't know. But it's supposed to be, yeah. Um, All right, moving right along. Mary, that's for you. <laughs> I hope yeah. you're doing well over there in Ireland. Oh, Mel reminds you of yourself sometimes. Nice. That's a big compliment. You must be a nice person. <laughs> you must be a really nice person. Um, Two always years put ago. a smile on my face. Oh, the scene of me dancing. I have another dancing bit coming up. I danced in season five. Remember? 
Oh yeah, oh, that's a good one. Oh, that's a really good one. Oh, that's a good one. Oh yeah, you're gonna love this season, guys. This season's so good. It's so fresh. Oh, it's so funny. Oh, it's so dramatic. Oh, it's so exciting. God. It's tragic. It's romantic. <laughs> it's gleeful. It's suspenseful. It's got darkness. It's got light. It's got hope. It's got faith. It's got laughter. It's got everything you could wish for and more. And you only have to wait till next July. <laughs> Okay, this is to Yuko. Yuko, signing this to you, sweetheart. Seven more months, Maddie, and then you can watch me dance again. And does she dance a storm? I do. Here you go, Yuko. Okay, Sasha lives in Brisbane. Please write. Thanks for your support. Also write Nathan Riggs under your sig. This is a gift from my friend Sasha, a great super fan. I, Jody, am in heart failure. Oh, Jody, and has she has been there for me. Oh, Jody. Signed photo of Gray's cardiothoracic surgeon seems fitting. Oh, Jody. Well, I'm really glad that you have the support of a friend like Sasha, and I wish you all the best in your recovery. Um, this is just for Sylvia. <laughs> Sylvia didn't write a note. <laughs> to request his picture for him too. Mm. Deepa. Mm. Oh, maybe happen? my shop's closed for today, Deepa. Just because there, there's like hundreds. <laughs> so we're trying to get as many done as we can in this session, but... Uh, it would be lovely if he could, but I think that would be... Um, we don't have it would be more for rude. today. It would also just be rude to other people <laughs> if we did that. You know what I'm saying? It's not It's not anything uh, against you. It's just but I will, open, I will open up again in the new year once I'll find some time after Christmas and all that jazz. So... Deepa, I will send you one on the next signing. And this is to Sasha, well, but it's Jody. It's coming to you, I guess, and you're gonna give it to Sasha. Please give Sasha my love and uh, all the best to you. To Jody with a Y, the eyes are the window. Victoria, Victoria. To Victoria, Solder, wherever you may be, I hope you're having a lovely afternoon or whatever time zone you're in. Who knows? You could be asleep right now. No, she'll be there. Times all around the Where world is she? right now. Where is she? I have no idea. I don't oh. know. That's what I'm saying. We don't know. We don't know where she is. We also don't know where Emma is. Emma. Okay, there you go. That's to you, Jody, with a Y. Wherever you the are. Eyes are the window to the soul. Hi, Mark. You did my cameo in the hallway of your hotel in an evening. Huge fan of what was I doing in the hallways of a hotel in the evening? Yeah, what were you doing? I don't know. <laughs> Huge fan of yours. I was the lawyer, but now I am the win job. I guess that's between jobs and it's frightening. Oh, could you write to never give up in life? I need a push in the back right now. Inez, you sound like you're doing just fine. You know exactly what to do, sweetheart. You just keep on keeping on. Keep on trucking, Inez. Just stay open and have faith. And remember, 
Say no. Say no to the good so that you can be open to the great. You deserve the best, okay? All right, take it away there. <laughs> Say no to the good. Yeah, sometimes like, oh, I'll tell you, yeah, it's good. No, sometimes you've got to know you deserve great. You gotta yeah. say no to good sometimes in order to make way for great. Don't let good be the enemy of the great. I well. But if you settle for mediocrity, that's fine too. I mean, that's that's totally fine. I don't. I'm not judging. I'm just saying if you want. Yeah. I well, but I but I. Uh, uh, all right. I'm not gonna expand on that because I think that would be incorrect. Um. This is to J Kelly and Jason. Nobody wants to hear that story. As much. <laughs> Very counter to what we're doing here. Okay, to Ennis, uh... <laughs> well, Thanks, Courtney, for being a Sophie fan. I had a lot of fun returning to This Is Us and was sad to not be there for longer. But unfortunately, I was, fortunately and unfortunately, I was here working on Virgin River. So, to you. Alright, in this, here we go. Got a little message there for you. To Mike, a fellow Torian. His birthday is May 5th. <laughs> What's your date? 15th. Bonjour, Martin. J'espère que tu vas bien. J'adore Virgin River et Blaise Anatomy. Je te trouve formidable dans le rôle de Jacques. Je suis un patient de voir le petit saison. Peu de dire quelques mots en français. Gros bisous de Belgique. So uh, why you got that message and not me? Um, Mike. <laughs> Marilyn, Marilyn. This is for you. Um, fellow Torian. Torian? Is that how we say it? Torian? Torian. 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 To Stacy, Stacy. Stacy, because Mel's sister. Uh, <laughs> uh, Mark's sister. Mark's sister. Yeah. Well, Mel's sister in law. Law, right, right. Yes. Okay, et voilà, Marilyn. Uh, C'est pour vous. Gros bisous. There we go. Five, you're a photographer and a sewing machine enthusiast. I too enjoy photography and sewing. And uh, does that mean she's an enthusiast of sewing machines? Sounds like, like it. She just collects sewing machines and fixes Maybe. them. Or you think she's enthusiast Possibly. like sewing things with the machine? When I tried to tell Martin that I quilted, he made <laughs> fun of me really hard. It was very rude. I got pretty pissed off. I was did. like, how dare you? You really did. I did. You really did. You were being a shit. No, I wasn't. I just said it. It just doesn't sound like a very exciting thing to do. And then you were, you said something. I was like, I was like,
I've never, I've never hung out with anybody who's been in the act of quilting, so I'm just wondering if it like evokes a lot of enthusiasm from everyone else in your life. People think it's cool, okay? Because it's such a nerdy. You know what? That's why yeah, it's cool. That's the only reason it's cool is because it is kind of. Because young women like myself in the young, modern age. Young. <laughs> Jack would be so supportive of Mel's quilting. He actually is, come to think of it. Well, yeah. Kind of, you know, he's yes. a, a, can't say too much, but yes. Way, way, well, much more, yeah, supportive than you. Yeah, oh, 100%. It's not that I'm not supportive, I'm just, I'm just really curious. It just really shows the glaring difference between Martin Henderson, the person, and, and Jack, Jack Sheridan. Sheridan. Character. Jack has a way bit bigger love for quilting than me. It's true. <laughs> no, no. He's just. Does, does, does your husband really love it? Like, does he like get into it? No. Does he, he like drag it out? To get into quilting, I think it's just an appreciation of someone's interest in a craft that is the nice, the nicer way to be about it instead of being like, why would you do that? Because that's literally what you said to me. You were like, why, why would you want to ever do that? Yeah, you never answered. Because that was such a fucking rude question. It's not rude. It I'm curious. It's like, why would you? Why? Like all the things you could do with your time on Earth, you ch you actually volunteered to do that. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just honestly it's curious. It's like, to me. Like, <laughs> you're so. Like you do photography, and I'm like, oh, that's cool. Like I get that. Like yeah, you go around, you take photos of people and buildings and but sunsets. Just because you don't understand somebody's interest in a craft and you think that it's silly doesn't. I didn't say it was silly. I said, why would you do that? That means and you, you have... think it's silly. Well, unless you tell me a reason, and then I'm like, oh wow, that's not silly. That sounds cool. I might try that one day. But you're yet to elaborate on why you do it. But I'm sure it's. Super I think cool. I enjoy the geometry of it, and I like the pre precision of... I like making a pattern, creating a pattern. That's what I like about it. I don't know. And I like sewing. So is, it like, is it like something that you get lost in? Is it kind of meditative? Yeah. 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 Okay. I never answered you because I thought it was rude. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure there's plenty of things that I've said to you, and you've gone, why would you do that? That just sounds like, no. why would you go camping? Why would you, why would you want to like ride like your bike camping. through the rain, mountain biking? No, I, I mean, you are a very sporty person. Yeah, and I bet you, there's lots of things that you're like, you've gone like, ugh, no, why, I, why would you do that? Mm, no? I just don't do those things because I don't want to break my bones. Right. I don't want to, I don't want to. judge wanna, you for it. I don't want to quilt because I'm I just, not a jerk. I, I just basically. don't want to, I don't want to like, Pass out from boredom. <laughs> I'm not telling you don't have to be quilting. It's fine. You don't need to quilt. I think it's safe to say I won't. <laughs> I know you're not going to. I was hoping you were going to like say something and I'd be like, oh wow, I can't believe it's like you've ripped the scales from my eyes and now I can see that this is clearly something that I should be doing. No, I would never assume that you would want to do such a thing. I was exactly. I was just sharing a simple fact about my interests. This is for you, Elizabeth. <laughs> I thought you were half Thank joking. you for being a huge fan of the show. Um, she says this show means so much to me. It's a pleasure watching you. Thank you for being a part of it. Well, it's, it's my pleasure to be a part of it, even though my co-host here doesn't uh, support my... your Crocheting, no, was it? My, uh, Here we go. Potties. That's this, well, this is to Carol, but it's for your mum, Carlisle, in Pennsylvania. I hope it brings a little smile to her face. And if it doesn't, perhaps you could introduce her to the craft of quilting. 
Might do the trick. Okay, to Emma. That should be made up. That should be made up to Carol, actually. The Carlisle, Pennsylvania is the town they're from. Uh, this is to Amy. Uh, Thank you for the sweet <laughs> note, Amy. I'm so glad that you could enjoy you the show. It's almost 2 p.m., you guys. You know what that means. That was to Carol. You know what that means. Sorry. Okay, this one's to Carol. It's time for a glass of wine. <laughs> you know what that means. Time for mom to have a little helper. I'm going to sushi tonight, and I'm very excited about it. You got a, su a sushi hill. Sushi uh, downtown. Oh, downtown. yum. Okay, this is to your mom, Carol. Here you go, in Pennsylvania. All right, this one is to Emma Miller. Let's do some this gold. is to Casey, that's my husband's name. I wonder if it is a It's a boy or a girl. Boy or a girl. <laughs> we don't know. Or maybe a, maybe they, not sure. Here you go, Emma, that's to you. Just smoking aces action. Sandy from England, just to say absolutely love Virgin River. Thank you, Martin and Alex. You both are so funny off camera, but really not funny at all in front of the camera. <laughs> Is that what it says? No, no, I added that last bit. <laughs> No, You're we're both... not funny in front of the camera. No. It's not exactly we don't get comedy any... in front of the camera. No. <laughs> You did a little funny beat the other day. That was cute. With what? Um, I don't know. You came in, or oh, we're not going to say what scene it was, because that's... You came in. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Beat beat. It's a little it over the top, but yes. Good no, to it was it cute. Bit, I right? liked it. Okay. To Sandy. To Sandy from England. Hi, Sandy from England. Just to say, I see love you. Thank you, my name. Oh. Yeah, I think everyone's going to really enjoy the last two episodes of season five because there's a lot more lightness and, uh, yes, humor and playful. It's just, it's a really sweet, funny sweet. couple of episodes. All right, now I have to find a quote. The end is going to be so good. Like, yes. so good. That moment was perfection. Here uh, we go. Sandy. That's Are you, for you talking about what I'm thinking you're talking about? Yeah, what we did the other night. Well, what you, you did the other night, to be specific. Oh. That's which I cannot really? speak of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know. No, 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 no. You think it's going to be good? Yeah, yeah. It, I know it is. It's, mm. See, so here's the thing. Sometimes we do scenes and we're like, oh, did that work? <laughs> <laughs> it's the truth of it. Is that even is printable? That even, yeah. Does that even make it to air? We, I mean, a lot of the time we've done scenes and walked away and looked at each other like, oh no. I've just gone like this. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. It's over. It's oh, over. It's, it's over. It's, it doesn't get any worse than that. But somehow. Somehow it comes together. I think You were our... very good in that scene. Really? Yeah. I... Yeah. Really? Yeah. Are we thinking about the same scene? The, the, the last scene we did. No, 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 no. You were terrible in that. <laughs> <laughs> See? It does happen. It does happen. That was just. No, you weren't. I'm joking. Hard. You weren't all horrible in that. That'll be beautiful. But no, the, the scene that we shot. It wasn't great. It wasn't great. It was supposed to be this, like, big. Yeah, but the way it lives. It's going to be gorgeous. But the, the, the scene where I'm on the porch, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. The last scene we shot together, I think. I wasn't really in it much. Oh. Yeah, that. This is to Laura. You didn't see my face, though. Did you? It's to you. Yeah, I did. When? Uh, the playback. Oh, you watched a playback? Yeah. It's really, oh. really nice. That whole thing is going to be... Yeah. yeah, it was very sweet. Yeah, yeah. It's great. Oh, and that's the Yes, end. yeah, yeah. 
Um, yes, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, that'll be good. Yeah, it will. It will. It's nice. That'll be great. Yeah. People, are, people are gonna love that. Oh yeah. yeah. They'll lose their shit. Yeah. That was a good ending. Yeah. Had a lot of nice notes and yeah, it's great. Oh, let me know your favorite season of the year and why. Oh, I thought you meant the show. My favorite season of the year. It's got to be summer. I just love being outdoors. I love being in the mountains and on the ocean. And I love building fires and being outdoors. So summer, Sandra, is my favorite. Our I've got a good quote for you, actually. Yeah. Uh, the internet, the internet is slow, but the gossip is fast. Oh yeah, that was a funny That's one. A good one. Here we go, Sandra. Whatever your favorite season is, I hope you get to enjoy it. I quite like fall though. Like we're here in Vancouver right now, and it's autumn. And it's like today, it's a sunny day. There's a float plane that just flew over the city. It's going to land in the harbor. There's little sailboats bobbing on their anchors. There's pine forests on an island. There's snowy mountain peaks. There's birds flying through. There's different- It's gorgeous out right now. It's ridiculous. So pretty here. I love it. But I'm, I like it because we're only here for a short while. To Melissa. Melissa, I wrote a quote on the bottom for you. To Laurie. Where are you? This is to you, Laurie. Mwah. I did, didn't I? Are you That's completed? Look at the number on the back. Yes, you just did Lori. So okay, nice. I'm Carolyn. Okay. Are you going to do Thanksgiving or are you going to be on a boat for Thanksgiving? Oh, you. November 25th, I'll be on a boat. I'll be in Mexico. I don't think they do Thanksgiving in Mexico. Oh, look, see, that annoys me. That's They hang the sweaters on the coat hanger. And yeah. It That's that, drives yeah. me nuts. You should fold them, right? Yes. So this is to Caroline. So tell us what you're going to do for Thanksgiving now. Well, I do like, you know, a traditional American Thanksgiving. Well, for all of those non-Americans out there, what would that be? Okay. Um, <clears throat> I will do, I will brine my turkey. Ooh, that sounds sexy. Yeah. Because the turkey, you it need to ask basically permission Basically gives it a little turkey. bath and you give it a little cold bath. I do, um, well, you, you take a big old pot and you dilute a bunch of salt and seasonings, bay leaves, uh, white wine, and, you know, like juniper berries, peppercorns, um, mustard seeds, all sorts of things. You put the turkey in it and, and you take, like, wrap up a turkey bag and leave it in the fridge for 24 hours. It soaks in all soaks that flavor. Soaks in all of the salt and the juices, so it, keep, it keeps the flavor when you're cooking it, and it keeps the moisture in when you're cooking it better, because you've just pumped it full. You've of, hydrated it. Yeah. It's oh, really wow. Really good. Really good. She's, she's quite the entertainer, this one. Yeah. Quite the homemaker. So we'll do that, and then um, I'll make, night before, I usually make yams, I used to mash them and put marshmallows on the top, but now I like to do them cut up into cubes, and then I roast them in like um, butter and, and uh, brown sugar. Um, so it's a very you can do low maple syrup caloric too. dinner. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. You'll get your. You gotta watch. You gotta watch yourself. You gotta um, go for a run before dinner and then after, after dinner. Yeah. Wow, that sounds and I amazing. Used, I used my stepmother taught me the, the stuffing, which people call dressing in the Midwest, well, the Midwest but it's um, you take uh, Italian sausage, uh, you do the sauce, you know, saute the sausage, and then you add the breadcrumbs, and then yeah, what do you put? 
chicken broth. Thyme or anything, like, like herbs yeah. or anything? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Onions. Yeah. So that's a separate thing, right? And then you just bring that out, you serve that, you cook yeah, that you bake beforehand. It. Yeah, so I cook it the night before with the yams, um, stuffing, and potatoes. Then I'll set up the green beans, and if I do carrots, I'll cut those up the night before. Because the turkey is a big to do. Yeah, just once that. you're roasting the turkey, you have to keep basting, basting it. How many? How often? Like every you hour? Every like hour, every thirty minutes. You know, um, it you, takes a while. Do you burn yourself? Because are you bringing that sucker in and out, or you? Yeah, doing well, it in I have a new stove. Thank you very much, Persian River. I have a new stove. <laughs> so the new stove has the it like glides. a fire um, yeah, you said what I'd love to have a picture of talk I don't have any from that film I don't think so um, but I'll see if I can do that after this session put it in the shop okay uh, okay sister Peggy happy birthday gift from my best friend 44 years we share a love of Virgin River, among many other things. It has actually brought us closer to long distance. Ah, oh, thank you for making the world a bit brighter. Ah, oh, Peggy, love to you. Well, this is, yeah, this is to your friend, Peggy, right? So to Peggy. Happy. Birthday. With love. And okay, that's coming to Peggy soon. This pen seems to be getting a little dry. What are you gonna boring? do for um, for Christmas? You're gonna be in New Zealand. Uh, yes, Christmas I'll be in New Zealand, with the family. Um, and um, what do you guys have? What's your Christmas? holiday New Zealand tradition. This is for you, Nancy. Thanks uh, for watching. When I was young, my granddad would do like a roast lamb or roast beef. Mm -hmm. um, my parent, grandparents were all past now, but we often go to my sister's and she usually does a big holes, uh, like baked salmon. And yeah, that's we'll nice. Do a, I love a baked salmon. Yeah. It's kind of simple in a way, but really yummy and everyone loves it. Okay, this is to Sabrina. Oh, Sabrina! Uh, here she is again, folks. To Sabrina Volga. Volga. <laughs> I drove to Vancouver from North Carolina to meet you in August. I met Andy and Dave. Oh, you met my mate Dave. Oh, Dave is everywhere. Uh, you did a cameo for me last November. I want to meet you so much. Oh, I'm planning on returning to Vancouver in Don't September. Don't complete on that one. Just show you it. must meet next September, obviously. Uh, please let me know how I can meet you. Oh, Sabrina, well, maybe I'll meet you. Photo. You met Andy, who's Andy? I met Andy and Dave. Andy. Oh. This oh, is the one Andy. for Sonia, that was for somebody else, I think you checked it off right oh. so. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go find what that happened? again. Don't, just uh, oh. do that one to Sonia, to I'll fix this one. Sabrina. Uh, At least I 
made it out to the right person. I didn't just write it out to the son of Sonia. I'm still there. You know what? The, the fat tip's not doing it for me. It's, oh. it's actually, I can't. I love a fat tip. I can't fit it all in there. Okay. Um, That's why. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so what do your kids do at Christmas? I mean, they just must be beside themselves, right? Just, I mean, yeah. Do you have traditions just, the night before? Do you like? I always, I always do one present. They can open up one present. Oh, sorry, I'm gonna bring that last one back. I, I had a brain fart. No, no, they, they, like I said okay to the previous one of okay. you, but I didn't. Right. Hold on, just a second. Okay. Um, so they get one present open the night before. Yeah. And is it usually? That's the next one. That's the cabinet one. Is it? Is it um, like a teaser? It's not like the big one, right? It's just something to. I mean, they just get a ton of. My kids get too many presents. I'm just. I think it's. You did Sabrina, and now you've got Kathy, right? No, no, I got it. There was the one prior. Oh, one right before that. Yeah, okay. the one that was in the queue. I accidentally marked it complete, and it's not. Birthday gift to Catalina. I I just I buy them too many gifts. I think because I'm overcompensating for the childhood that I wanted. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm sure a lot of parents like, do, that. do that. And vice versa. Yeah. Maybe parents that were spoiled and realized their parents didn't give them any real love. They're like, oh, I don't want to bombard them with presents. Yeah. Instead of maybe, yeah, I'm sure it's hard to find. I try to just give them all of the love and the presents. Yeah. Well, that was. I'm That's sure right. I, most kids would want that. Was that 217? What did I just hand you? Would have been 216. Whatever I, No, what? Sabrina. Right. Yes. Okay, so right. 217 is what you have, but you marked it as complete. I'm unmarking it. So that should put it back into your queue. Just refresh your page. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry guys, I've lost track here. I'm trying to have a conversation and do all this at the same time. Okay, so if you just refresh that, it should put 217 back. Like there? Yep. And then inside you. There we go. Ah, yes! Mary or Marika. Hi, Martin. Love Virgin River. The story, all of you actors, it calms me down in times with lots of worrying about my three kids. Oof, that's a lot of kids. Some with special needs. Oh, now just battling breast cancer. Holy cow. Oh, also at 43. Can you write something positive? Tia. I think that means thank you. Tia, you saw Belgium. Oh, uh, you know. Marika, if you say it that way, I would be delighted. Um, I'm sure breast cancer is quite terrifying. I have a dear friend of mine that went through that a few years ago. and Yes, it was scary, but she did very well. And with all the right care, I hope that everything works out Fine. To Barbara. Kofi forever. <laughs> Kofi. Oh, how do we pronounce this? Musa? Did I say it right? Musa? Musa? Sure. Okay, Mary, there you go. Have faith, stay strong, and don't forget to have fun. Here we go. Fat tip. Yeah, just. My friend, she can't, can't get down with fat tip. Have you got a silver? Just shout out to our boy Todd here from Streamly, as you may have noticed. None of this would be going anywhere near as smoothly if it was no. just Alex and I on our own. We would be here for... Three days. Three days. 
We wouldn't make it to work on Monday. No. <laughs> So thank you, Todd, for all your assistance. You're Streamly, by the way, have been an incredibly amazing company to work with. They've been so quick and professional and made this whole process easy so that we can provide the service to you uh, with no stress in a timely manner. So thank you, Streamly. Okay, this is to Kathy. Kathy, thank you for being a faithful fan. I've got Marissa, who's a nurse, who's watched me be a nurse in two different shows. <laughs> well, what was the nurse now? Well, I was a nurse on This Is Us. Oh, uh, Sophie yeah. the nurse. Sophie the nurse. Nurse manager. And then Mel Monroe, nurse practitioner. So no wonder you're so good at it on Virgin River. You just, you've already been trained to do it. I didn't really do, no. We never saw Sophie... Oh, she we saw her in her scrubs, but we never saw her doing her work. No. There wasn't really enough time in that show. I imagine if I had actually gone back when they asked me to go back as much as I was supposed to, that that would have happened probably at some point. But unfortunately... How interesting, though, that you've been cast twice in a row as something... Something, something caring something, about me. I think yes, there's something really naturally something about my passionate face. and sweet. Okay, there we go. Kathy, much love to you. Thank you for being a faithful fan. Heather, I'm a saving a spot for you at Jack's Bar. I guess that's what you want me to write. To Marissa. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Marissa, the nurse. Um, I hope I'm oh. doing my job correctly on the show. We try. We try to be on top of our um, medical uh, techniques. And well, we have techniques. shout out to uh, hmm? uh, Yarrow. Yarrow. Yarrow, yeah. We have a wonderful nurse. Is she a nurse in real life? What's her actual? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Who helps us get it all looking like it's the real world. Yeah, we try to keep it correct as much as possible. Um, yeah. Technically accurate. Technically accurate. Okay, this is to this dude's wife, Heather, who said she'll be embarrassed by the attention. Sorry, Heather. Try not to embarrass you too much, but I'm saving a spot for you at Jack's Bar. For Emily and Jess, hope you guys are having a great day. Hang to a photo watching. This is a new one that just popped in. Oh. We've only got a few left. So. Great. Great for me. This is Rachel. Hi. I love everything you do. You're an inspiration to me and you've changed my life for the better. Really? What did I do? That's for Heather. Can you write a message to me? the hard and bad times, please, from Buffalo, New York. Well, how about those Buffalo Bills, though, eh? Doing pretty good. I think they might be the team to beat this year. Though them and uh, Eagles. the Eagles. 8-0 eight, eight of the Eagles. My LA Rams are just disappointing. Uh. <sighs> Guys, oh, I love Virgin River. You guys make it feel so real. Being a nurse, especially the last few years, has been rough. Watching Virgin River has been a beautiful escape. She's a RN, a registered nurse. Thank you, Alana. Yeah, the last few years has been especially for our medical friends. Okay, Alana, that's to you. So maybe Alex, you can, um, there we go. Mm -hmm. You can ask some fans some questions. You can 
I chat to them. Okay, to Sarah, I'm 47 years old from Adelaide, South Australia. Love you as an actor, would love a great quote. All right, Sarah, Sarah, no worries, mate. This is for Rachel. Rachel, I wrote, um, never give up today because you never know what tomorrow will bring. It's true, that's that's what I live by. That's my little just note, keep my going. note to self. My Okay, Sarah, don't sweat the small stuff. And most of it is small stuff. There you go, love from me to you. Oh. Cecil? Cecile. Cecile. Cecile, thank you. Cecile. Well, I gotta, how, what do you think that one is? Cecile's 34th birthday. Oh, happy birthday, Cecile. You want to give a shot at saying that name? <laughs> no, but I don't. <laughs> no. Don't. But thank you for uh, asking. <laughs> you look, gosh. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm not Caesar? even. Caesar? Maybe it's like Caesar with a. Caesar? With like a, a female Caesar? 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 Caesar. Caesar. Anyway, to Caesar or Caesar. <clears throat> I have never been live for this long. I don't think I have either. Well, last week, <laughs> last week was rough. I was on my own. Happy birthday, Cecile! Oh yeah, were you just sort of losing your mind? Oh yeah, no food. Oh, <laughs> no. It was bad. oh, you must have been a mess. It was. Uh, oh dear. There we go, Cesar. Okay, what do we got here? Write this number on the back. Oh, yeah, oh. to Debbie. Okay. See, I don't like those thin tips. I don't like it. Yeah, but if I have to write something. If you need to write something small, then yes, but the, the thicker tip is better because then you can see your name. Yeah, it's I mean, more, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's more. Pronounced. True. Alright, Debbie. Now the next is Davina. I was thrilled I was thrilled to hear that I was thrilled to hear you say that your mum is Scottish. I am a very proud Scot. Ah, Davina. Hmm. Uh, I don't know a Scottish greeting, but no, I don't um, either. I'm a little bit Scottish. Um Jeff. Do you have a little bit of Scottish in your dude? I gave you a fat tip. Um, yeah, I've got Scottish, uh, I'm Irish, Scottish, uh, English, Italian, you know, a little French in there. I all have that All of Western feet. Europe. Yeah. I, I have the teeniest, tiniest bit of, um, East Asian there too, so. East Asian? I don't know. Could mean anything, really. All right, Davina, you lovely Scot, you. Yeah, my mum was born in Edinburgh. My grandmother would always say, Martin, get in the hoose. I'd say, Mom, what's a hoose? What's a hoose? How can I see the rest of these messages if they're, like, not coming up all the way?
things, yes. Dedicated, heartfelt, mm -hmm. attractive woman. She's she's great. She's a great lady to portray. Yeah. Oh, nice. Good for young girls to see that. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Tracy. All right, Kata from Hungary. This is for your 40th birthday. Happy birthday to you. Here we go, Kata. Kata. Happy birthday. 40 years young. Feels like a lighting a fire day, huh? Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Jane Wilkins. Okay, Jane Wilkins. Jane Wilkins. What does that name sound familiar? Yeah. Don't know. I don't know oh anything my about Jane. Goodness graciousness. There you go, Jane Wilkins. It's for you. To Sarah from Arizona. Thank you. To. Sarah, hi from Arizona. My favorite look you give Jack. <laughs> this look? <laughs> That's funny. No. <laughs> Thanks, all of you cast and crew, for taking so much time out of your lives to make this terrific show. Thanks, Kristen. Big up, Sarah from Arizona. Thank you. Now we have Adriana Fernandez. Oh, a special message to a Mexican fan. Uh, let's see. Let's do it. Hola. Mm -hmm. Adriana. This is also the look that I gave to Martin Henderson in real life, too. Like, just hurry up. Just, <laughs> just, just say your line. Just say your line. We don't need to do another <laughs> take, Martin. Martin, it's fine. You're going to do the same thing that you just did in the last one. <laughs> Exactly the same, I promise. Sometimes it's better. Sometimes. Sometimes. Not always. But you know what? If you got the time, why not take a shot? Yeah. But by usually by then I'm just like done with the scene. And I know, you're like, wanna move on? Let's do it. We're done. <laughs> okay, next. She's just one and done and I just yeah, just like uh oh. I'm usually I You're learning your lines. Take two, you're doing the scene, having learned your lines, and then take three, you're like really jamming. <laughs> no, you know your lines by take one. Sometimes. Sometimes. Well, Adriana. Um... Oh, Boston, I would say enough. I would say it's enough. Here you go, Adriana from Mexico. Muy bien. Okay, Jennifer. Love you watching me on Virgin River. Love you watch. Oh, I love you watching me on Virgin River. My favorite fan. 
guess I write all that, yeah? Are you watching me over from Yeah, I think that's, you're supposed to say that to, yeah, hi, thank, to Jennifer, hi Jennifer. Love you watching me on Virgin River. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right. Okay. Do we have a thin silver? Mm -hmm. You know what, this is finished. One of mine might be. I'm get you a brand new one. This one is. This is your last VIP sign. Hi, Jennifer. To Leslie. But, you know, I have a bunch more to do anyway, so I'll just... Do you want to just continue on with those while he's signing those to his? Uh-huh. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. I'll probably just do those. Yeah, I'll just grab those. We'll just keep moving. Hey. Hi, everybody. Still here in our pink matching robes. I just got a message from Gail in my saying apartment. I can't believe you guys are still there. Gail, come entertain us. Come cook for us, Gail. I wish Sibby would come over and hang out. Oh, why are you better? Oh my so God. she can watch us sign things? Oh, she can just chat and have a... We'll keep you signing the rest while he finishes. get scammed. Oh, Farina, Florina, I'm sorry. Don't fall for that stuff. I would like to have know how to behave, but I'm so happy to have your real autograph. Oh, Florina, please everybody ignore anybody contacting you on Instagram or Facebook or Google Hangouts or Messenger or any social media platform if it's not on this account. I don't have another account. I never will have another account. I, it's not me. It frustrates me so much that people still get fooled by these assholes. Um, this is a no. message from, this is very sweet. So Leslie, Leslie, Gafford um, of Alabama. Her motto is Uno Mas. She lost her husband to ALS last year. Oh, and that was our battle cry. One more, one more road, one more trip, one more memory, one more day. You're gonna make me oh cry. Oh my goodness. That's so sad. This is for you, Leslie. Oh, you break my heart. Well, we'll just keep going with your list then. And the number two there. There you go, Florina. That's for you. Eighty-eight. Tracy. Tracy. I'm from the high school math teacher from Nevada. This is to Tracy from Nevada. Nevada, Nevada. Yeah. And I appreciate uh, the joy you bring to fans like me. <laughs> Your spirit positively reminds me to be grateful for each day I'm given. Oh, Tracy, good. We must be grateful for every day because we don't know how many we've got. I'm pretty sure life beats the alternative. So, you know, make the most of it. Sending you lots of love, Tracy. One o'clock, everybody. <laughs> One o'clock. Why didn't you bring Zibby over? I wasn't joking. Um, I did. I just texted her. I said, hi. Oh.
I know. We filmed that in Hawaii. Such a good gig. Uh, I love Virgin River as well. You're awesome. Thank you, Marin. To Marin. Cool name. Much love. And best wishes. Uh, thank you, Marin, for watching Off the Map in Virgin River. That's to you. Okay, Joanne, I watch Virgin River literally every day, and it is my comfort show. It brings me so much happiness and joy. Love to you. Cute. Uh, and love oh, the show so much. Oh, yes, please. To Joanne. Thanks for watching. You guys are the best fans ever. There you go, Joanne. Be with you shortly. And to Jen. Nothing a few cold plunges didn't cure. Sounds nice. Going to New Zealand, Australia next March. Hope to learn some Maori first hand. Oh. A t shirt? Saw 660 at the Troubadour last month. I saw 660 in 2021 in Wellington at a stadium. It was awesome. Great taste in music, Cindy. There you go, Cindy. Hope you have a fabulous time in New Zealand. And Australia. Don't mean to leave Australia out. Please add, climb your mountain, challenge yourself. You're a precious soul. Your mama must be proud of the human you have become. Oh. All right, Todd, am I writing the entirety of that or just up to precious? Uh, to challenge yourself. Sounds like she wants the whole thing, but it's up to you how much of that you want to put on. I guess. I'll do it all. Okay. Yeah, it's your sure. yeah. okay. To Melody. Here we go, Melody. Hmm. Let the game to begin. Melody. <laughs> Climb your mountain.
There you go, Melody. I hope that's all eligible. <laughs> eligible. This looks rather like a doctor's scrawl, sorry. She said, wait, are you still going? Martin is live still, Jesus Pancakes. <laughs> Jesus Pancakes, that's right, Zibby. Jesus Pancakes. That's a bumper sticker. Can you add Mel and Jack? I just did Jody right now. I love stuff for the ages. Can you share your favorite that's moment? That's more Alex, that's said number 29. How special was the proposal scene for you too? Oh, the proposal scene was pretty special. Yeah, it was sweet. Yeah, that was really nice. Yeah, that was pretty. Um... Yeah, we get to do lots of nice scenes together. We set the bar very high for couples, though, I've got to say. <laughs> well, it's, you know, it's nice when you work with people who listen and respond, as opposed to people who just decide what they're going to say and how they're going to say it and stare right through you. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm not going to comment on that, but yes. It is very you easy to do out. a good job with an actress of Alex's ability. <laughs> it's true. No, I'm laughing at oh. Zimmy. She said this is taking 18 business days. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Mal and Jack, a love story for the ages. Okay, Alyssa, Mel and Jack, a love story for the ages. Oh, I had one of those too. Oh, was it from Melissa? It was from Melissa. Oh, there you go. I bet I know which Melissa it is. What do you mean? Well, I don't know. I just, there's a Melissa out there who's a big fan. Oh, I see. You've already had contact it with It might be, might be her. I don't know. I'm not sure. That wasn't specified. Ooh, that's your water. Uh, thanks. Okay, I have been a huge fan of you since Off the Map. Wow, a lot of Off the Map fans. That's cool. I didn't realize that many people watched it. Loved you in Grey's, but really love you in Virgin River. It is my all-time favorite show. Can't wait for season five. I was part of the signing last time, and I wanted to do it again. Elizabeth, look at you coming back for seconds. What do you want to do here? I don't, this is a contraption. I don't know. What... Oh. This is what, this, I'm going to show you guys. This is what Martin makes his tea in. Okay, he brings this to work. I shit you not. I, I mean, I don't really know. It's a teapot. What do you mean? You don't really know. It's a teapot. Two Elizabeth. I've never seen a teapot like this. Is this normal? I don't know. This is. I, it's beautiful. It's really. It's metal. It's ceramic. It's ceramic? Yeah, yeah. Really? Yeah, it's crazy, right? It's really nice. It's super. For teas, he brings his teas. I, I bought so much tea from these people that they actually gave me that um, pot for free last time I went in. <laughs> you know you spend way too much money in the store when they start just giving you, giving you stuff. For yeah, time. well, that's nice. Yeah, that's a nice photo. Yeah, you should get some. You should do a photo shoot. I haven't done a photo shoot in so many years. That's why I did one. And yeah. you know what? I'll tell you. Tell me. It was, it was paid for. By the photographer? Yeah. Oh, you're kidding? No. Oh. I need to get on I that. Had to, I had to pay for um, hair and makeup um, because they gave a certain amount and that's what the Right, and then you charged. paid. Right, right. That's fine. But you would kneel. 
Oh. Uh, they do it. They do it. Yeah. You could get one person to do it. The things that we talk about. No, I should totally do. I haven't done headshots in over ten years. Exactly. Yes, I will do that when I find a minute. Okay, to Elizabeth. No, I did Elizabeth. Next is Laura. Hi, Martin from Northern Virginia, right outside of DC. Thank you for providing us viewers with amazing entertainment. You're a gem of an actor. Can you write for me one of your favorite Jack Shooting quotes? Thanks so much. Laura. Yes, Laura, of course I can. To Laura. Uh... for me, Virgin River best show ever. Linny in Arizona, uh, a fellow Commonwealther, happy Guy Fawkes Day. You guys don't even know what that is, do you? What? Mm -hmm. Oh, Guy you Fawkes do? Yeah. Oh, you do? Guy Fawkes was this dude in, oh, okay, yeah. in, in England back in the day and he tried to blow up Parliament with gunpowder. That was real? Gunpowder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Can we put water in this? Yeah, and so every 5th of November, um, New Zealand, Australia, England, maybe Canada, I don't know, uh, let off fireworks to celebrate this dude that tried to blow up Parliament, which I think is pretty cool. Wow, it's you blow it up all the way? Yeah. And then stir? Uh, no, I just let it sit. Okay. Thank you. Do you want a mug with it? Oh no no yeah cup two men with best wishes. There we go, Lynn from Arizona. Happy guy, folks. And now Markel. It's a cool name too. Two. Oh, thank you. Here we go, Markel. To you. To Angel. <laughs> She's putting tattoos on that, so funny. Who is? Tibby? Tibby. Hey, nerds. <laughs> Of you, but I think it's time to kick the, the 
Hi, Angel. They're real cute, but they sort of stopped being cute after noon. <laughs> <laughs> Vicky, Maybe your you biggest followers in Texas. I'm worried about your blood sugars, especially you, Martin. Do we need to fly you in some food? <laughs> A little DoorDash action? Tell me what I gotta do. So how can you wrap this up? Vicky, come and sign for me! Vicky, your biggest follower in Texas. Okay, Vicky. Almost done. Says I have 63 left. <laughs> That's including the offline duels. Oh, yeah. We need to get him through his stack and then we'll be done with the stream. Right, right, right. We'll right, right. Rest. Um, get you through your stack. Girl. Listen. I, I've been hand feeding Martin food. It's true. And uh, tea. I've moved on to a glass of rose <laughs> because it is that time. We figured by this point we might as well just stay in our robes and get <laughs> and, uh, <ready. laughs> getting dressed seems pointless. Pointless and just not necessary. Seems like a waste of time to get dressed actually at this point. Um, those tattoos look really good on you, by the way. I feel like she wants to get a whole sleep. I know you want to get a sleep, but I actually really like those birds, just like like that much. But I do have to warn you. That um, it hasn't been recording the entire time. <laughs> oh no! I just. Okay, Jill. I just. That's made you. A whole recording. Thank you, Jill. A whole recording. From Louisiana. And it didn't record. That was so lame. The version of it, you were saying made the trip a couple of times, but couldn't run saying, into you. Oh, Gary. I've been feeding Martin, but, but he brought extra food, which is good. And um. Like sneak a bit into the show. We're not gonna get dressed anytime soon. Uh, when are you gonna be done with all your business? Um, what time? What time am I seeing you today? <laughs> Let's get that rolling after this. I'm almost done with this. Carrie, that's you. Carrie from what's VA again? Virginia. Virginia. There you go. Lovely to meet you up here. Okay, Nancy, I leave it to you to write something. Thanks, Nancy Cottington from Middleton, Delaware. Okay, to Nancy. Oh, 
Oh, no. <laughs> okay, this is to Tina. Aw, Tina. Okay, thank you, Tina. Sending you lots of love. For myself. How many eggs do you get a day? There you go, Tina. A lot in, this, a lot in the um, summer months. But we, you know, we started with 12 chickens and now we only have four. And we, so we only have three laying hens and a rooster. <clears throat> and we need to get more chickens. Um, especially because the winter months are coming and I need them to have, you know, they all roost together and they need the warmth. I mean, I have heaters in there and stuff. And like, if it gets really cold at all, tarp around the outside of their coop and the heaters will be going so they'll be fine. And a lot of people say don't heat your chicken coop because... Don't che heat your coop. Don't heat your coop because they're like, well they're chickens and they should just be hardy on their own. But... Right. I'm a mom as you can see. There you go. Lots of love to you. Happy birthday Lisa. Happy 50th. 50 is the new 35. Okay. Next we have Caroline. Hi Martin Greens from Milford, Pennsylvania. I'm a big fan and love the show. Just wanted to say thank you for bringing more kindness and love through to your audience and fans. Oh, hoping for many more seasons of Virgin River. Caroline, we hope we're gonna make this for you for many, many years. We'll see what Uncle Ted Sarandos decides to do with the show. But for now, we are very grateful that you are enjoying it as much as you do. Okay, there you go, Caroline. I need to take a shower too. From Pennsylvania, from Milford, Pennsylvania. There's a Milford in New Zealand where I grew up. Okay, this is Susan. Milford in Connecticut. St. Louis, Missouri. My mum's 85th birthday is November 21st. Oh, she is an incredible mother to 12 children. Can wow. you imagine? No. Oh. Nope. <laughs> Shut it down. That's amazing. Wow. I am impressed. Wow. Very impressed. Wow! I can't, I can't have 12 children. They'd eat me alive. Oh, I'm gonna give her a birthday wish. Thank you, this would mean the world to her. Oh, okay. So this is, I guess this is to your mom, Susan. I hope it is. To Susan. To Must her be. mother, Susan, probably. Yeah, well, she doesn't Hopefully have a birthday. Hopefully she pulled it out, right? Okay. All right, let's try it. <laughs> let's hope. Let us be hoping. Dear Susan. Happy 85th. You legend. Love. This wishes. Oh, I got a Herman. Great name, Herman. You should have put a bingo card together before this. A what? You should have put a bingo card together before this. Yeah. Here we go. Cool Happy scene. birthday to Susan, turning 85 on November 21st. Well done, Susan. Last time you wanted to know where people were from. I'm from South California, Southern California. This is Marissa from Orange County. Okay, will you speak in Jack's voice? Uh, I don't know what that... Uh... Jack's voice? Oh, yeah. Well, I guess... You want me to do an American accent, Marissa? Does that sound about right? You do it all day, every day. No, she says, she love, I love your accent, but signing my photo while you're when you speak in Jack's voice. Just, just okay, Marissa. I'll do my best. Marissa. From Orange County. This is not, this is not a VMP, I'm going to say it anyway though. Um, my 13 year old daughter, Nora, has watched every season of Virgin River four times. Wow. She loves you and Martin. I can't figure out. She's 13? How to buy a picture of both of you. So oh, she must have jumped on it. The yeah. yeah, but you both, but if you both sign this, I would be so grateful. 
Marissa, there you go. That's from me to you. Happy Saturday in Southern California. I bet you it's nice and warm down there. Okay. Deborah or Dan. Oh, Debbie. Congrats on your role in the River. Totally obsessed about it. Every day I watch. Wow, it looks worse as a therapy for me. Do you have anything in common with Jack? Um, what do you have in common with Jack? Uh, well, I think I'm romantic, but I'm not sure if I'm as romantic as Jack. Are you? What's the most romantic thing you've done? Jewelry and writing love letters and mm -hmm. yeah, love like letters that. are nice. Yeah, my husband used to write me letters all the time. Now he's just like takes you for granted. No, the last time he wrote me a letter, it was really sweet. He put it. Um, I came to visit, you know, because I've gone back like three times this year. Gone home. Yeah. Gone home to visit, and I. You know, it's just a lot traveling all the way across the country and then back and working and yeah. the whole thing. And when I was coming back, he, he slipped a card into my bag. It was oh. a little, yeah, it was a card and it said um, something like, you know, we're, I just wanted to you to know that we're so appreciative of all of your hard work and oh. we love you so much. Oh. And it was really sweet. Oh. <laughs> I think I found it on the plane, and I was like, oh, oh my God. <laughs> oh, that's so nice. It was really sweet. And when I was working in um, in Los Angeles, he sent me these cheetah shoes because I had this cheetah print outfit. Oh, was, you told me the story. Yeah. yeah. He said, you can go anywhere. And it came at such, it's like the perfect timing because I was feeling so low. I remember, I, uh, yeah. So great. I remember talking to you around that time. Was that when you were doing This Is Us and we met Sean and... Mm -hmm. Yeah. No. I just said had a hard day at work. Well, there you go, Deb. I'm a, I'm a romantic like Jack, but not as romantic as Alex's husband. There you go. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I sort of jumped on that bandwagon <laughs> to be like, oh, yes, yeah, my husband does all of these things. But, you know. Okay, this is to Erin. She's asking me if I've ever read any of the books. And Erin, I read a little bit of the first book um, just to get an idea of the world that Robin Carr had created to see how we might bring it to life in a way. But the writers, you know, for better or worse, have also done their own thing with the characters in a way. And so I've sort of lent into that more. Um, but thank you very much for appreciating the character of Jack. My understanding is quite a bit different than the books. Which is why. You guys are so cute. Here we go. Glad Martin, you've been keeping your blood sugar even. Kind of. <laughs> it's been a little bumpy here and there. And yeah, what's the point of getting out of those robes at this point? Now they just become like they move from like morning robes to smoking jackets. So the rose feels really appropriate. Please write that. Um, so I'll be done with all my business.
This is to Wendy Meadows. I wonder if they were born in October. To Wendy. Do I do Wendy Meadows? I guess I do. Should I do two Wendy Meadows or just two Wendy? Either way. Two Wendy's. Feel his choice. Here you go, Wendy. To you. To Anna with one N. Two. Is that right? Anna. Anna. Two Anna. Yep. This wishes. Thank you. Yeah. The last time my girlfriend left Vancouver, she put post it notes in my shoes, in my work bag in drawers in my trailer, in the fridge, on the back door. Like, so for days, I'd be like, open the fridge, I'd be like, oh. oh that's so yeah, adorable. Very. You a little. She is very, very sweet. I try to measure up, but she sets the bar a little high for me. Thanks for doing this for your fans. Did I do Anna? You just did Anna. This yes. is this is Beatrice. Uh, Beatrice, thank you, Martin, for all of you give. You are son or oh, S U N. Beatrice, fifty four from Paris, France. I now know how to cook bread. Yes, granola and pavlova. Beatrice, this is so good. So nice to share some. I taught you to the bread. The bread. You did. So, so you have turn. this one to thank Beatrice. For that and bread. You taught me how to make pavlova. Oh yeah. Did you ever do the the granola? I didn't, oh, but I so want good. to. It's so good. You have to give. Me, did you give me the recipe for it? I thought I did. I don't know. I can, I can find it. So good. It's kind of easy. And I've looked up recipes online. Yeah, I know, but this is the shit. Oh. Uh, to Beatrice. Uh. Last two are just signatures. Okay, Beatrice, there you go. No personalization, mm -hmm. no uh, special instructions. So. I am a grandma of two. I have some boys. Gail. Same age as your kids. Mm -hmm. So whatever makes you happy, I'm going to have that. Uh, this woman, Gail, is 71 years That's old. Sorry, 71 years young, mm -hmm. and I love to dance like nobody's watching. That's mm -hmm. your last one? Yes. Until we get to the rest of the test. <laughs> Until we go to Dutch Wars. If you need a break, now's the time to take it. Thank you. Before we'll get through his thing in the stream. Today. And then we'll take a break and then get into the rest of the stuff. Shouldn't take that much longer. Before. Oh. Tomorrow is not promised. I like the way you think, Gail Alder. Live for today, for tomorrow is not promised. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Nice, Gail. Hope I'm dancing like no one's watching it for 71. Thank you, Gail. Much love to you. Okay, Ingegred. In Ingerd. Ingegird. 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 Gift from a fellow Fisherman of a fan. Is that a gift for from? Yeah, so somebody got it for her. Okay. Two. Oh, yeah. Ingegird. Oh, darling. Ingegird got so many. There you go, Ingegird. Well, I guess it's for the person who's getting it, Ingegird. There you go. It's coming to her soon. I'm going to be drunk by the time we're done. But what's this here? That's our duos. Oh, good lord. Yeah. DQ. 
Tikia. You did this one before, right? Tikia? Tikia? If you want to go to the top of that stack, those are just signatures only for later. If you want to start working on those. That, yeah. that stack right there, those two different prints. This one? That one and the stuff below it, but. Are you good? Dikea. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I can just do these. Um, and, and the other one because Martin's already signed those. Oh, oh gotcha. Yep. So all of them. I'm going to do that. Oh, yes. Here's someone from Ohio. Uh, Ohio Natives, The National. Oh, my favorite band. It's a must that we be Spotify friends. Ha ha. Oh, Mackenzie. Right on Mackenzie. Just here in my jammies. <laughs> Hanging out in my jammies. Food <laughs> 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 in my jammies. <laughs> <laughs> it's, I'm uh, not drunk yet, by the way. It's, this is just how I am. Yep. It's pretty normal. Yep. Pretty normal for me. This wishes. Get a little punchy. <laughs> you would get punchy too if you were signing autographs for three hours. <laughs> three and a half Okay, Diane, there you go. Sorry about the audio on the last one. I hope this got to you loud and clear. Okay, this is to Laura. This is a surprise gift, and I do not have her shipping address in the Netherlands yet. Okay, the billing name and address are in my name. Okay. Got it. So this is going to Sharon. Sharon Noll. May I contact you after signing with her address? Yeah. That's, you guys that's, can that's, do that's, that. That's her stream where she can contact. Yeah, you guys will uh, be able to enter in the shipping address, Sharon, um, on Streamily. So, because these, all these prints are going to go back to the Streamily office, and then from there they'll go out to wherever you want them. So if you make sure they have the correct shipping address, they'll get it to Laura. So that's to Laura. So this yep. is to Laura. Oh, what a nice friend you are, Laura. Give this gift. I mean, Sharon, your friend Laura. There we go. Lots of love to Laura. Maggie Gertner, Gartner, Gertner, I'm not sure, but uh, Gertner. Uh, thank you for taking the time to do these signings. It means a lot to all the Virgin River fans. Oh, guys, it means a lot. You guys care so much about the show, so thank you to Maggie. Okay. Best. Wishes to Maggie. Love. Martin. There we go. Going to you, Maggie Gertner. And now Maria. Oh! Bahan fan, all the way from Barbados. Wow, okay. Maria. Bahan fan. That's my favorite. Uh-huh, then. Oh. All oh, the Am I supposed to write all of that? Sending lots of love to my favorite Bahan fan. I would just say sending lots of love to my favorite Bahan fan. Okay. So Maria. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. Lots of love. Down is where all yeah, is going. Favorite. All right, there you go, Maria. It's coming to you. And now we have Leah from Germany, turned 20 in October. <gasps> Another Libra. Oh, I love ya. So this is a present to myself. Oh, that's nice. Virgil has really become a go-to comfort show this year. Hope it continues for many more seasons. Love to you and Alex. Oh, say thanks, Leah. Thanks, Leah. <laughs> Thanks, Leah! Woo! To Leah! You... <laughs> you... Oh, shoot. Here we go, you gorgeous Libra, you, Leah. Thank you. Hey, D. Oh my goodness, D is on her fourth run of Virgin River. D. Oh dear. Uh, adore the show, love all the way from Ireland. This is a birthday present to me. Oh, give me that last one. I think that was a birthday present to herself. Wasn't it? For Leah? Yeah. Uh, I would have to go back and look. Yeah, it was. I think it was. Oh, okay. Let me, let me, let me quickly double check. Then. Yeah, okay. Oh, you got one on double check. I'll do D, yep. Oh, this is a birthday present to D. Oh, I quite love it when people spoil themselves. Mm-hmm. Happy birthday, D. Do you approve of all the shopping in here? Yeah, I wish I was a bit better at it. River. Oh, love to Mel and Jack. Betty Brown. Oh, that's a sweet name. Two. Betty Brown. Love these ones. Ooh. There you go, Betty Brown. That's for you. In North Carolina, is that the Panthers? Carolina Panthers. Carolina Panthers. Good luck with the NFL. Betty Brown probably doesn't give a toss about the Panthers, but who knows? Okay, Joanne, hi again. This is my third. Oh, Joanne, you greedy little thing. You know what? You can't have too much of a good thing, can you? All right, Joanne. You're going to be a collector of these. <clears throat> there you go, Joanne, with 
two ends. Much love to you. Shirley, don't call me Shirley. This is for my mother, Shirley, if possible, a belated happy 86th birthday to wish to her. Oh, Shirley, absolutely that's possible. Happy birthday, Shirley. Suzanne Hybertson. Okay? I'll just do your first name, I think. Two. Suzanne with two ends. Can you do it right there, Yeah, five more to go. Here we go, Suzanne. It's for you, Hybertson. And Andalucci. Netherlands, as you always say. All right, lots of love, Martin. All right, all right. Do I always say that? How else do I say that a lot? What do you say? All right, all right. Maybe I do. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. That's not something that stands out in my mind. No, maybe I don't know myself as well as I thought I did. I Two. You, well, you don't. You know why? You're because you're saying it with an accent, and most of the time. That we talk, you're, you know. All right, all right. Oh, maybe that's an American thing. All right, all right, all right. You have to put a southern twang to it. You get all McConaughey with it, right? All right, 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 all right. I get older and they stay the same age. All right, all right, all right. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Good line of dialogue that one. Andalucci, all right, all right, all right. All right, I'm gonna say that. Oh, all right, that's a love. All right. Let's love. Here you go, Andalucci. I feel like my pen might be suffering, right? It seems to be. Okay. I'll take one you just, just discard that. Judy, if we don't love ourselves, we can never truly love someone else. Oh, please fix if I miss a part. Love your work, Judy. Or so you can never truly you accept love from anyone else. Right. Mm. Yep. To Judy. I'm really glad I drove that home into myself when I was in my 20s. It's a good idea. Yes. <laughs> very important. Yeah, if we don't love ourselves, we can never truly love someone else. thinking about getting involved with someone and you notice that they don't love themselves, run. <laughs> what, if you're, what if you're married to somebody that's like that? What do you do? If you're already married to them? Yeah. Oh, uh, just... I know people that are married well, then, to people Then you just, not. you gotta learn to love yourself, right? And No, but what if you do when you're married to somebody that doesn't love themselves, right? Oh, personally, I... If it wasn't a happy marriage, I'd, I'd bail, yeah. Right. Well, I think that's what happens a lot of times. Yeah, life's too short to not enjoy it. Okay, there we go. Judy, lots of love to you. All right, Mickey, I'm hanging this above my mid-century bar. I'm home. It will be the perfect touch of class and conversation. Ooh, I like your style, Mickey. Thank you, my and Also, what is your signature drink, if you have one? I'd have to say I enjoy a Moscow Mule or North Pole Mule. Cheers, Mickey. 
Ooh, you like a drink with a kick, huh? Ooh, a signature drink. You know, I like anything with yuzu in it. Any Anything with yuzu. Yuzu's my favorite citrus of all, and I just love that flavor, so. They have, they have a really nice sparkling yuzu drink uh, at Foods. Here? Uh -huh. Oh, wow, okay. It's just like, it, it's in there, it's just up the street. And it's not high sugar? Really as long as it's not like, so, yeah, I you love it. You put it on ice. It's a Japanese citrus. Oh, that's okay, so nice. I, I, I'm, it's lemon. I'm thinking of the, yeah. Greek, the Greek liqueur that tastes like black licorice. Oh, you use, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, 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 that's a whole that, other that's thing. That's you, Zoe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's just a, yeah, it's just lemon. A kind lemon drink. Yes. It's like lemon. It's just it's similar to a lemon, but it's kind of got a bit of orangey in it, it too, like, um... It, yeah, it's just, or, or, it's kind of herbaceous, I think yeah. one would say. Yeah, yeah. I love it. Yeah. Gosh, look at all those sailboats out there right now. I know. Right. Two, um, two Mickey. Oh, Mickey, you're so fine, you're so fine, you blow my mind. Hey, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. It's two. Faster, could have clapped. Yeah, we definitely need to clap. Two Mickey. Um. Oh, so Mickey's got a bar. His signature, his signature drink is. I'm gonna write. Have a drink on me. You yeah, haven't really had Jack making too many drinks before, have we? No. Here you go, Mickey. Enjoy the bar, mate. Oh, man, Are you I've done some admin -y stuff in the office, and but not really, because Hannah's working the floor a lot. Uh -huh. Preach is there in the kitchen and partnering up. So yeah. Partnering yeah. Happiness always. Oh, to Karen. I like that. Happiness. Happiness. <laughs> it's a good thing we're right at the end. Happiness, always. Oh, dear. I almost made it. Well, we're, we're fine. I'm just quoting here. Yeah? Okay, here we go. Here you go, Karen. Happiness to you, always. This is the final autograph of the live stream. Oh, come on! The final autograph of the live stream goes to none other than the hardest name that I've had to say today, of course, Leia Vanisha. Leia Vanisha. Sounds good this to me. photo is for a young lady who works with me. It's a surprise for her, all of her hard work. Oh, it's from Gail Alder. Oh, good on you, Gail. What a sweetheart. Okay, I will make sure I spell this name correctly. To R A Y E V A N E I S H A. Okay, two over right here. This wishes. Okay, there we go, Gail. That's for Raven Yasha, if I'm saying her name right. And that brings us to the end of today's live signing. Oh, care of myself and my other pajama clad friend, Albert Brugerich! Yeehoo! I can't do that. <laughs> yeah! Bye. Bye, folks. Thanks for joining. Join us next time. Have a blessed weekend. See ya. See yeah. ya.